Welcome back to Orange Hat Reviews, people. And today we're going to be going over a little bit of a possible spoiler leak from the Hollywood or HeroicHollywood.com. They have basically given a plot synopsis or summary on Terminator Dark Fate, saying that it's this wonderful new take in this and that. I think it is BS. And I'm going to let you all know. So if you want to go into Terminator Dark Fate fresh, if this does turn out to be real, don't watch the rest of this video. Because it might contain heavy and massive spoilers. So here we go. Basically, Skynet is dead. They succeeded in Terminator 2. But it was replaced by an alternate AI future and the alternate AI is called Legion. Legion sends a Terminator in back to 1998 and John Connor is killed. Which leaves humanity basically fucked. So now this girl in the Terminator movie called Danny or Daniela Reyes or whatever she's the new savior. Yeah. Isn't it great? Woman power! And Grace, the chick that is, uh, looks like a man, and says she's human when she's whatever, is apparently an augmented human, and that's basically all they give. She's sent back to protect Daniela. So, my thoughts on this. If this does turn out to be true, and I go into the theater and see that this is true. Terminator Dark Fate will receive a 0 out of 5 from me. Subjectively. And this is a person who has been fan of Terminator for a while. I'm not happy about learning this. I am not happy that James Cameron thought this was even remotely a good idea. It shows that James Cameron has lost all objectivity and integrity and decided to shill for the SJW agenda, where women need to be the future of everything. And he basically has pissed on the John Connor story. I have heard other uh, articles that say the John Connor story continues. Well, if this one is true, then those other ones are a lie. And if those ones are true, this one is a lie. So, take it with a grain of salt. That's what I'm going to do. And when I see Dark Fate later this year, I will make sure to give my review. And, like I said, if this plot synopsis is true, 0 out of 5 subjectively. I will give an objective review and a moviegoer review for it when I see it. But automatically, this one will receive a zero score on subjective review. Because I am sick and tired of, Holly, or of Hollywood pandering to SJW agendas and pushing SJW agendas. It is no longer a viable Thing. It never has been a viable thing. So yeah, that's the video. If you guys like it, subscribe, share, comment, jet, or ring the bell, all that jazz. This has been Orange Hat Reviews, and I'll talk to you guys on the next video. Bye.